so you know, let's see. Oh, I gotta hit my friend. Get pistol whip, kid. I oh, know, I'm like, huh? Oh, that guy's pissed. was that? But anyways, yo peeps, what's going on? Tips and what's up, I'm going to be bringing you a commentary, some hardcore domination. I think I end up going 47 kills and something like 13 or something like that. I was just dumb, just running around their spawn the entire game, just kept on trying to get in their spawn. It was a fun game, and it was semi-decent, it's not the best, but, you know, it's just fun, and I gotta talk about some stuff. So, what is that? I wanna know. You guys know me, I never snipe. Ever. Ever, ever. Well, I do in like, you know... I do in like Battlefield, etc. I do snipe yeah. once in a while, but I don't snipe in Call of Duty, nor do I quick scope, nor do I no scope. That was my first time ever running a sniper rifle, ever. And I, yeah, ridiculous, ridiculous. That's not quick scoping. I don't know what it is. Uh, it's beyond easy. I couldn't tell you exactly what it is. It's, it's ridiculous. And, you know, Another thing I don't understand where I don't understand what this is, is why they added supply drops and COD points before they even fixed the game. That's ridiculous. It's so hard to play with friends nowadays. You're getting kicked, you're getting black screened, you're getting disconnected from host, you're getting host migrations, you're getting absolutely everything that we should not get if there was, there was, um independent servers like if there was servers in this game like they said they were gonna be you know it's it's they're dedicated servers sorry um i don't i don't understand there is no dedicated servers in this game if there was then we wouldn't get kicked when the host dashboards that makes no sense another thing that we wouldn't see is your friends grab a and b flag while you're still trying to spawn in that makes no sense at all Call of Duty really needs to work on this game before they add stuff, before people want to purchase stuff. I mean, if you guys are going ahead and you guys are purchasing stuff already, then fine, but I, it, that's your choice, man. But me, no, I totally disagree. Another thing that I'm happy to hear is supply drops may become illegal. It is true, and uh, if they do become illegal, I would love to see it because games would return back to they were back in the day. Where you bought the game for X amount of money and that was it. And then you just grinded for the things that you wanted. You wouldn't have these people running around with pay to win weapons doing better than absolutely everybody else. And and etc. I mean you do see that once in a while even with you know just regular games. But they grinded for it. They leveled up to whatever they needed to unlock that weapon. Um, before you obviously. Uh, but w like... I don't understand what this is. I think Call of Duty really came in a rush after they heard that supply drops may become illegal in different countries. Because if it does become illegal in different countries, it will be coming to other countries after that. Uh, so they're probably just rushing it out as fast as they can so they can make as much money as they can before, if they end up going banned. Uh, then Call of Duty is really going to be struggling. But I, I would really like to see it, honestly. Tell me your guys' thoughts. I would love you guys to tell me if you guys agree or disagree. If you guys would like to see supply drops gone. Would you guys like to see supply drops stay? Etc. Just let me know. It would be uh, curious. I would like to know your guys' thoughts as well. I don't completely hate them. And I do think that they should be in free-to-play games. Because, you know, the, those developers spent lots of money and time developing games to put out for us for free. So, I do think that they should have some revenue, of course. But games that we've already purchased, etc. should not have... Uh, pay to win it should not have uh, extra supply drops unless they're cosmetic only cosmetic only I could totally agree with etc but even that um, you know I, I just don't think that the supply drops should be in the game I think they're absolutely destroying a lot of games out there and games would be a lot better without them that's my personal opinion sniping in this game is something that needs to be fixed I'm sorry for all you quick scoping fans out there but that is not quick scoping I have sniped in Call of Duty ever since well, I'm, I'm not a sniper, but I have sniped in previous Call of Duties, and I've been playing since uh, Modern Warfare 2. So, 
Yeah, it's just, it's just, I've been around for a long time. I've played Call of Duty a lot, but this is just, ah, this, I don't understand. They will, they, they gotta be fixed. There's no other way. They, they gotta be fixed, but, uh, the supply drops need to be fixed. The, the host migration bullshit needs to be fixed. Everything needs to be fixed in this game before they add more stuff to the game. And that's what I don't understand. Another thing that you quickly guys want to know, if you guys have a good match and then it asks you at the end, did you have fun last round? S always say no. Always. Because they deny it, but it's there. Skill-based matchmaking. You guys know it's there. That's why they're asking you those questions. So always say no fix this game make it like it used to be and this game would be absolutely awesome till next time peace